Hello, this is Arlen again, guys, and today I've got a MMS send issue fix for you. Um, short or long story short, went to T-Mobile. They couldn't fix this issue. I went ahead and looked on the internet, found some found the uh, some information on the T-Mobile forums, and I wanted to share it with you guys. So here we go. Uh, just the other day, I started experiencing a MMS send issue. I received a picture message from a friend of mine and wasn't able to go ahead and forward that out. Uh, I had had this issue before with, an, with a feature phone that I used to have, and it was a pretty easy fix called T-Mobile. They went in, fixed it, blah, 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 whatever. And I was back out, you know, whatever. This time, I took the phone into T-Mobile, of course it's Android uh, so it's a little bit different I took it into T-Mobile had them look at it see what they could do with it uh, we went in changed some settings uh, uh, talked to uh, support for about an hour and a half trying to figure out what was going on with the phone uh, and were not able to solve the issue uh, I went on to the forums I found a, uh, a post in there about this issue it turns out there's there's several people having this issue uh, this is the first issue that I've had with the Froyo update uh, since I've got it in January um, but anyway here's how to fix it go into your wireless network down here to the bottom is mobile networks right here in the middle is access point names up here at the top when my phone was acting up this said tell killa and below it it said internet and of course this is highlighted over here um, I tried to restore it to default basically just refresh it that did not fix my problem so the next step I did is I went in here to this menu it brings up the settings for that that internet deal. Uh, clicked menu down here at the bottom. I clicked delete APN. I got rid of the Telkilla or the whatever that is, Telkilla internet. Um, and it brings you out, back out of this screen to a blank screen here. On this screen, like I said, it'll be blank. So you'll hit menu again down here at the bottom it says new APN reset or reset to default go ahead and click new APN and that will bring you into this menu up here at the top where it says name you'll click that and in that box you'll go ahead and put T-Mobile dot or space US and then click OK on that the box immediately below that is APN and there you'll go in and you'll put in there EPC dot T mobile dot com Now the boxes below here, the proxy, the port, username, password, server, you won't change. This MMSC, you will change. Okay, and as you can see there, I've got, you put in, go into the dialog box and put in HTTP, semicolon, forward slash, forward slash, MMS, dot msg dot eng dot t slash mobile dot com forward slash mms forward slash wap enc click ok on that it'll bring you back out here on mms proxy you don't touch it mms port you don't touch it and these next two here 
mine was set this way when it was at on the tail killer deal also so I didn't change these if yours are these numbers you won't have to change them uh, you got 310 for MCC and MNC you've got 260 let me get that to focus for you guys and then down below those two you've got authentic authentication and APN type you don't have to change those when you're done changing the settings up here go ahead and go down here to the bottom and click save which is the middle setting there and what that'll do is bring you back out to the this menu here and it should look like this when you're done T-Mobile US with EPC dot T -mobile dot com and then that uh, should be lit up green over there and you'll notice when you delete the tail killer your 3G uh, deal or edge or whatever you might be on at the time will disappear that is due to you actually getting rid of the internet on the phone and then you're reinstating the internet on the phone with this T-Mobile US deal when you're done with this go ahead and power the device down uh, power it back up go back into your messages um, and then send yourself a picture go into your gallery and send yourself a picture uh, what this will do is re-register you on the network telling the network that your phone is able to send and receive MMS messages um, again this is a video to help you fix the issue if you do have the issue I hope this works for you guys it worked for me um, I was a little fast in the uh, explanation because I'm trying to beat the, the time limit here. Uh, if you have any questions, go ahead and post them down below in the pants. Uh, I will put uh, in the pants also in my description, I'll go ahead and give you a link for the forums. I'll give you a link to the actual post uh, where this fix was found. Um, and I do believe that's all. Uh, let me know what you guys think, um, and I will keep on keeping on, try and bring you guys good information as I can. Again, this is Arlen, and I hope this works for you. Thanks for watching my video. Y'all have a great evening.